Good morning and welcome back to Vegas October 1 Sounds. I just had a couple of small things to uh, share with you this morning. And there was somebody asking about the potential impact of the bullet <laughs> rotating or exposing more of its surface area in terms of how that would affect the sound. And it got me to thinking that I've shared very, very little on the dy dynamics of the flight of the projectile. And so I thought I'd share with you two of the, the types of things that I look at, even though I, I haven't really um, made any videos on it. And I don't think I will because other people do such a fantastic job on it that uh, it would be kind of pointless for me to recreate it. But anyway... Uh, for the people that are really interested, this is an example from the Army uh, where they've studied the flight dynamics of a 5.56 five, round. And it's not entirely mathematically oriented like the stuff from NASA. And so you can get some pretty good handle on it if you spend your time looking at it. I know these graphs can be intimidating, but just you know, read the text and take away what you can. And there's a lot of information here. And I'll leave the links to this document in the um, description and also then this uh, other series that I'd like to point out is from uh, how we pronounce this guy's name and in particular part 70 I found really interesting and relevant to the question that was asked but he has 70 plus videos just on bullets and their trajectories and all that good stuff. So if you go to his channel, and I'll leave a link to it, and you scroll down a little bit, you'll find the Sniper series, and that's where you go looking. So anyway, I hope this is information is useful to some, and uh, we'll catch you in the next one.